Hey guys, Dr. Brad Bodle, and tonight I wanted to make a post that's a little atypical for me, but I've been reading more articles and social media posts lately about people who are anti-diet culture. Now, to a large extent, I agree with these people, and I think they make good points. The reason being, I do think there's certain diets out there that have become too restrictive and almost cult-like in their following. If you step outside the normal recommendations of that particular diet, oftentimes it is met with a lot of backlash and negativity. That being said, obviously I take a little bit of issue with it because a lot of the recommendations that I make for my patients and my community have certain restrictions built into them because we want certain health outcomes. Now, no matter what you choose, I want you to feel full of life, full of energy, able to maintain weight where you wanna be able to maintain it, have great sleep, and be able to enjoy the activities that you want to be involved in. But I think it's a problem when certain people who may be a little bit more naturally healthy, naturally fit, and are making recommendations to eat like they eat when not everyone has the same type of metabolism and physiology. And I think it's a problem when these people will say things like, oh, you guys are being shamed because you're being told to have certain types of restrictions. When in reality, I think it's almost a reverse shame because these people are confused when they're having issues with certain types of foods. And then you have other recommendations out there where people saying, nope, you can actually eat whatever you want. Well, truth be told, oftentimes people have problems with certain types of foods, whether it be the specific proteins in those foods or the specific types of macronutrient ratios. So as always, you need to figure out what works best for you. And if you can find those things, then keep at it. If you can find a dietary approach that allows you to be full of energy, lose weight, and feel great, then continue to do that. But just because someone on the internet, and I know guilty as charged, but just because someone on social media tells you that you can eat in a particular way and look like them, doesn't mean that they are right.